Like many of his colleagues, he's deployed here before. But unlike them, last time he was in the country, he was seriously injured. Sergeant Oit Ilza stepped on an improvised explosive device. I remember everything. Uh, the first few seconds, uh, it just went all black, blank and uh, didn't hear anything, didn't see anything. It was like I was in space with no stars. It didn't take much to understand that I got hit by an ID. Checked my left leg, that was gone. Right leg, that was open fractured. 24 hours later, Oit was flown to the UK for treatment at Selly Oak Hospital. Yet even from his sickbed, just two weeks after suffering such appalling injuries, he was determined he'd return to Afghanistan. I just joke about it, that I'm going to go and find my lost leg. I don't have the correct answer for it, actually. It just feels uh, inside that uh, the first tour got short uh, really, really fast. I mean, it just... Uh, I only stayed for a month, but the tour lasts uh, at least six months. So I had this feeling inside I have to carry on and finish my tour properly. And retraining as a weapons technician has meant he's achieved that goal. He loves repairing and maintaining the firearms his comrades use out on the ground. But when he sees the Estonian infantry leave on an operation, he feels a pang. I really want to go with them and do that all that action stuff with them. I know myself and I never want to put them in the danger because if something happens, just some mechanical part with my leg, uh, it takes at least two guys to get me back to a vehicle or something like that, so I'm going to cripple the whole unit with that. Oit may have lost a leg and seriously damaged the other, but despite all that's happened, this remarkable soldier remains resolutely positive about his experiences. I thought about it and if I could turn back the time, I still would go back to Afghanistan and uh, do the same stuff. Uh, so the, the injury has to hold me back. And, uh, I, I would like to do all that all, all over again. But yeah, if, if I could scratch out some of the memories, there would be probably the painful memories. <laughs> Other than that, no regrets.